In this demonstration, we're going to see how we can accelerate a parameter sweep using parallel computing. We have a model of an aileron actuation system which contains a controller. We would like to see how the behavior of the system changes when a parameter in the control system is varied. We're going to accelerate the parameter sweep used to test this behavior using parallel computing toolbox. We're going to generate the sets of parameters that we wish to test and distribute the simulations to two cores on my multi-core machine. We'll see the results of that parameter sweep and see that using parallel computing we can run it even faster. To perform this parameter sweep, we'll first need to open a pool of MATLAB sessions. We'll then generate the parameter sets we wish to test. We'll first run the simulation serially using the for command and then we'll run the simulations in parallel and see how much this speeds up our parameter sweep. I'll now switch over to the model so you can see how this is done. Here is the model that we're working with. We have a three-dimensional mechanical model of an aileron modeled in sim mechanics and the actuation system modeled in sim hydraulics. Within that system we have a control system where MATLAB variables are used to parameterize the controller. What we would like to do is figure out how the behavior of this system varies as a parameter in the control system is changed. To do that, we're going to use this MATLAB script to walk us through the steps. First, we need to make sure that our model can be run in rapid accelerator mode. So we're going to use this command in order to generate a rapid accelerator target version of the model. Next, we're going to generate the parameter sets that we wish to test. Next, we're going to open a MATLAB pool with two workers in it. The MATLAB pool is now open. First, we're going to run this set of simulations serially. Our for loop is defined using FOR, meaning that the simulations will be done in series. If we look at the simulation, we can see each time a new simulation is started, this message in the lower left-hand corner blinks. So 40 simulations are being run, one after the other, and the results are being saved in this out variable. This is where we're saving the um, aileron angle results. So we can see that running those 40 tests took about 32 seconds. Now I'm going to make one change. I'm going to enter the command par4 and rerun the simulation. So now the simulations are being run in parallel on two cores of my multi-core laptop. At the conclusion of this, we'll see how long it took. We're timing, this we're timing the results of this test using tick and talk. So we can see that this sweep has been completed in nearly half the time because we have two cores that make sense. And here we can see a plot of the results. We can see that changing the parameter in the control system results in better and better performance. In this demonstration, we have seen how we can accelerate a parameter sweep using parallel computing.